think of a bee, a bee or an insect that has a very, very tiny brain. With a very tiny brain, it's very, it's, it's much, it's very much quicker to go from, for the influx to go from one side of the brain to the other side of the brain. We have a big brain. It takes a long time. So in those insects, they don't have as many connections and as many neurons, so they can compute perception more quickly. And in fact, they have to, because imagine a bee, you know how quickly they go? In a bush or in a forest, you know, around the branches. If you ran at that speed, you would, you would crash in just about everything that's in your way. They don't. You avoid them. They see slow motion compared to us. So you have to change your mind on a few things with that. For instance, you're going on your car, on the highway, and all these insects are crashing on your windshield. If you're sensitive, you say, poor things, you know, they keep crashing on my windshield. I don't like that, killing all those insects on the way. And, but you tell yourself, well, they don't, they don't feel anything, but it goes too quick. Aha, mistake. Their psychological moment is much shorter than yours. They might well see that slow motion, you know, and they see the car coming. And it, this might last for the equivalent of you for 15 minutes, you know, and they say, I'm not going to be able to avoid that car, it's coming to me. And then it slows down, and then it feels like itself. This is, this is dark humor. Um, but it's, 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 an, it's an image that drives the point home. Your experience, the duration, is a function of your perceptual system. And if you want to say that the brain's behind it, well, it has to do with the brain's ability to slice up time. And it has a limit, of course it has a limit. And the limit of the brain in slicing up time intervenes on top of the interaction problem I, to I, I told you about. Those of you who are students here who might be 25, you think you're young, uh, you're just starting in life, that you can't afford the luxury of preparing your future rather than living, <laughs> actually living your life. So I'm, I'm, I'm preparing my future. I have, uh, I have news for you, and the news is that 25 years old is halfway through your life. But halfway through what's important in life, experienced duration.